The merchandise is now live for you guys to order if you guys are interested. The, this form will be down below in the description in case you guys are interested. We do have three different designs for you guys. Some 2K related, obviously some related to the 250K tournament. Free bread, chicken man, you know me, as well as have a blessed day that I say at the end of each video. So if you're interested in these shirts, you do get a $2 discount for pre-ordering them. If you do want a shirt, obviously you got to fill this out. Contact Nate on Twitter and we can get these shirts to you guys. Yo, it is good, yo. It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, we are going to be doing another episode of our road to the $250,000 tournament. Now, there's a lot of talk because current gen and next gen qualifiers are on the same day at the, at the same time. What console am I going to be playing on? I don't know yet. I, I really don't know. I'm doing next gen stuff right now. But I'll decide that at a future date, right? I don't know whether I'm playing on current or next gen in the first qualifier. We'll just have to find that out. But qualifiers are basically a month from today. So I have to do what it takes to get ready for those, okay? And I'm going to give you kind of an update on where we're at as far as the nobody spent squad account is in general. And we'll go from there. But if you are new to my channel and have not yet, please consider smashing that subscribe button as we are on the road to 80,000 subscribers. So here's the deal, guys. And, and when I say this, my account is not in a bad position right now. It's not, okay? You look at my team, it's not bad. Could it be better? Absolutely. My team always could be better, but it's not terrible, right? It's not terrible, especially, you know, once I, I don't know if Reggie's evil yet, but I need to evil Reggie. But once I put Gus Gerard in the lineup, it looks even better because then I actually got everybody I'm playing with. But Kind of an update on where I'm at. Domination, 57 out of 99. So, realistically, I don't have that many more games to play. I, I don't. I'm getting through there little by little. And we're just continuing to grind it. Token-wise, we're in pretty good position, right? We're at 78 right now. I'm going to probably only get one of these pink diamonds. Maybe we'll get more. We'll see. But I'm probably focused on Mitch Richmond. I think he is going to be the best out of all the pink diamonds for what I need. We'll have to see, though, because maybe Walt Frazier is going to give me more than more than what I need. I don't know. We'll have to just see. I'll, ultimately, I want Mitch, Walt, Dale, and maybe even Brad. I don't think Brad's going to be that bad, but we'll just have to see when the time comes, right? Uh, Brad is probably the least of my priorities. I, I, again, just because he's not that good on defense. But that's where I'm at right now as far as tokens are concerned. MT, I'm over 200,000 MT, which isn't bad. I do need to sell my Anthony Morrow. But I know a lot of people are going for Sleepy Floyd, and it's something I contemplated. But for me, if you get Sleepy Floyd, then you lock away all that MT. A lot of you guys might be wondering, Ty, are you going to spend money on this account? Right now, I haven't. Am I going to? We'll see. We'll see. I mean, I, obviously, as I haven't yet, but I mean, the odds of me not spending any money on this account just aren't good. As far as agendas today, win two triple threat offline games. So that's the first thing I'm going to do today. Get 10 assists with a token reward player in a single game and then score 20 points. So I don't have a hollow card and I'm kind of mad that that's a challenge just because, I mean, imagine 2K highlighting anything with hollow cards. It's fine though. 10 assists with the token reward player as well as winning two, assist, or two triple threat offline games. So I'm going to go into triple threat offline and I'm going to put Kyrie Irving in here to try to get the 10 assists with him. I don't know if I'll do them in the same game, but we'll try. I do think in triple threat, your opponent matches up with your, the squad that you have. So maybe I should have ran a, a little worse of a squad. I don't really know for sure, but my goal here, okay. My goal was just to make it somewhat easy, right? Get get Kyrie easy assist to surge, but I don't know if that's even going to be possible. Let's try with Glenn, see if this can work. But it's like, why why is Tim playing such good defense? I don't understand. There's one assist for Kyrie. And a lot of you guys are wondering, Ty, you got Kyrie Irving? I did. I think I got him yesterday. Maybe I had him on yesterday's episode. I'm not exactly sure. But I got Kyrie. I got Glenn. So, you know, my squad in general is starting to come together a little bit, right? It's not perfect by any means. I'm not going to sit here and gas it. But it's starting to come together, especially once, you know, I, I'm, I'm inching my way towards Mellow. I'm not necessarily super close right now, but I'm getting closer and closer day by day. And obviously the 400 XP today is going to help. So getting the tennis is done with the token player and Kyrie is easy. I, if I was you guys, I would do it with somebody, you know, maybe not as good. So maybe your matchup will be easier. But again, it's not hard to do. 10 is a perfect number, so you can do it in triple threat offline. And one thing I haven't talked about is Ron Boom. Heck. If I can get Ron Boone, I would take him. The odds of me getting him aren't necessarily the greatest, but I would definitely take him if, if 2K did allow me and bless me with him. Again, for me, is Triple Threat Offline my favorite mode in the game to grind in general? No, it's not. But it's something that has to be done, right? Okay, this is going to open up. What are the odds I pull Ron Boone? I'll lose my mind if I do. 500 MTX. 
500 MT is fine. Hey, I'm not going to complain. You want to give me MT, that's fine. So here, obviously, obviously, I've already gotten that one challenge with Kyrie done. I just got to win another game. Just going to put some golds to make my matchup easier. That's just something triple threat offline that I recommend. Obviously, I'm up against Rondo, who is, is going to be tough to kind of go against. But you guys can see Daniel Tice KD. So if I get a switch, for example, it's just going to be too easy. So that's just something I recommend. You're just even even for the token assist, whatever. I should have not even brought, honestly, Kyrie out here. I shouldn't have. I, I could have done it with any token player. I don't know why I decided to do it with Kyrie. Not mad at all, man. Two games decently quickly. Am I kind of upset that I had to play triple threat offline? Maybe, but I mean, there are some decent triple threat offline rewards. I'm not a super big fan of the top prize, but I mean, along the way, if you grind triple threat offline, there are some decent enough rewards. And honestly, even here, there's some tokens early on that are not bad either. So how do I get through triple threat online or offline? Just by chucking threes. First one was green. I don't expect this one to be green. Back to back greens would just be absolutely ridiculous. Obviously red and I'm fine with it. Let's see. I think that it, what is that? Nine or 10 wins in there. Okay. I get a free agent option pack, which is totally fine. I got three cards to choose from here. Let's see what they are. I'm going to choose Russell Westbrook. Look, man, I don't know. It doesn't really matter because I doubt I ever use these free agent cards. There are some decent amount of tokens in here and they can't be sold or auctioned. So if you can get all these jerseys, man, trust me, there's some decent enough tokens to be redeemed throughout there. Uh, so that's just something to think about. Same thing with, with obviously with courts. They can't be sold. These are all reward cards. But one thing I want you guys to kind of key in on for me, not that I'm necessarily grinding it like crazy, but my collector level is slowly but surely climbing, right? And, and really what you want to look for here is what are what are some things that are important, right? 60 tokens is nice, diamond contracts. But the first one that I see that could be like, wow, is Pink Diamond Jared Wallace. Now, Chris Paul and Tim Duncan are both decently cheap, okay? Am I buying them? Probably not. And if I do buy them, it'll be to sell them back, honestly. But my thing is they're not locking, so I think they're just going to continue to go down in price. And that's the hard thing I got, I, I have with it, right, is is buying these players and locking them in, right? Marvin Bagley is a guy I should have took it, taken into triple threat offline to get that challenge done. But a lot of this, this XP is just easy enough to do. Again, I'm not necessarily that worried about this grind for XP. I mean, I'm not. Obviously, 150,000 is a long ways from where I'm at. But you just got to chip away at it. We still have quite a few, quite a bit of time left for today. Gonna just play a game or two of Triple Threat Online. Let's see what team he's got. I see MJ, I see, is this, who is this? Andre Drummond? Why am I watching, is that Andre? Yeah, it is Andre Drummond. Why am I watching him right now? Okay, Kyrie. Okay, Kyrie, that was disgusting. How is that 10%? I don't know. Gotta get Glenn involved. I probably should not be attacking Michael Jordan. Nah, dude. Stop leaving Surge like I don't green with Surge. Dude's got an 85 three ball and you're leaving him wide open. Don't ask me why. I'm not the one. I do need to kind of make this guy quit or get a shutout here because I only got 15 more total points to give up. This dude is boxed. He doesn't have enough shooting out here either. Oh, yeah, that's boxed. I got to green it. I got to green that. Literally so boxed. Literally is so boxed right now. Check two. Thank you. Thank you for leaving Kyrie. I don't know why you would, but thank you. I'll take it. Come on. <clears throat> please quit the game. I'm begging you. I can't give up any more points, so please. Grab the ball, Surge. No way. Thank you, board. If you match up versus me in triple threat, I will sweat you. I promise. I'm just, it's the way I am. I'm going to sweat you. Check. Kyrie, you're, you're looking tough in triple threat right now, Kyrie. You are. And I'm not even dribbling or doing anything crazy with you. Shoot it. The post game is just, is, it's too much in this game. I'm sorry, but it is. It needs to be toned down. It's too overpowered. Check. Thank you. Right, you can do all the post moves in the world. I'm getting three points on the other end. 
The bad part is I can't allow this many points. Like, I got a good matchup for what I need, but I can't be allowing points right now. Thank you. Kyrie, you're looking too tough. You're looking too tough, and I ain't even green that one. Do not allow that. Like the only time you can score the ball is if you literally sit under the rim. Like, I'm getting mad. Like, That is deep, Kyrie. Oh, my goodness. Like, that is deep, Kyrie. That's a tough one. Thank you. Don't let him just move you into the pain. You got to take Andre Drummond off my court. You got to. I'm annoyed right now, badly. Check two. I'm, I'm just annoyed at like the situation. Like, why'd I give up six points to that dude? Like that dude can literally not do anything. I've seen Gus so many times. I'll take uh, more Gus's though. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna do with him, but I'll take more Gus's, the buses. Let's see. Four tokens, absolutely fantastic. I will say, triple threat online is rewarding. You can say whatever you want, but if you can get to the top boards with token, with MT, it's rewarding. I promise you it is. Another gust the bus. If I quick sell them, it's 1,000 MT. Hey, man, I'll take 1,000 MT anytime I can get it. Otherwise, I'll lock in for, I don't know who. I could get sleepy, but uh, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Is that gust the bus too? Already 2,000 MT at least and four tokens here. So, it's, I mean, you guys can, don't hate me. You can hate the game if you want, but that's a good ball drop. Top into one last triple threat online game for today. Let's see who he got. Monte Morris, Chris Boucher. I got to really get some stops on this dude too. Like I do. I can't just allow this guy to go crazy on me. I just, I don't know what else I can do defensively. Like that's what's driving me crazy. It's like defensively, I felt like I played good D. No way that's slightly. That's so bad. Check, thank you. Like, that's just so bad. I should not have been lightly. Kyrie, thank you for cooking. I will say, I Kyrie's hooping right now. I do think he's one of the most overrated players in all of 2K. I do. That's just my opinion on Kyrie. You can disagree if you want to, and that's fine. But that's just my opinion on it. Stuff are just dry. They just drive me crazy. Check. Thank you, Glenn. Thank you, Glenn. Nine percent. Come on, y'all can't allow like any more points. Y'all can allow eight more points or eight total points in this game. I think. That's fine. I just need to win the game. The board's gonna reset, but that's fine. I need another ball drop at this top board, so I just gotta win. Kyrie a hooper, man. He's a hooper. He's literally a hooper. Like, what do you want me to do on D? Thank you, board. The quit button's right there. Please quit the game. Please quit the game. It's not too late, man. I need this win without you scoring another point. Please quit the game. Oh, yeah, y'all got to give me some stops, though. Come here, we're fine. Come here, Serge. Check. Thank you, Kyrie. Hand down, man down. Please quit the game. I need you to quit the game. I can't allow any more points and you're sweating me. And you know you're not going to... Thank you, Glenn. Come on, Kyrie. Need it. 
Need it. Need it, Kyrie. Oh, my goodness. Need it. All right. One more stop. One more stop. I can't allow any points. I need one more stop. I've never been in this position before. It's good D, though. It's good D, though. Thank you, Glenn. It's good D, though. You stay home. Please just quit. Don't make me game you. Don't make me do it to you for game. Because I really will. He really got to stop right there. That's really tough. Thank you. He sold. Oh my goodness, he missed. Thank you. Thank the thank the Lord. Come on. Game him, Kyrie. Game him, Kyrie. Come here. I'm dying in that corner if you help. Oh my goodness, Kyrie. Told you. Told you I was dying in that corner. Stay home, my boy. Yeah. No. The game. So the good thing about that is I should have two more boards. Okay, is this a diamond shoe boost? Is that what this is? I need green. Definitely need green pretty badly right now. Let me get green. Okay, tokens. I, you know me. I'm going to take tokens if I can get them. I'll take two tokens. You know me. All right, I'll take that. I do want this diamond shoe boost, though. Because, like, these are important. A diamond shoe boosts are very valuable, I feel like. A lot of people don't really realize it, but I promise you I think they're va more valuable than people are kind of giving them credit for. That should be a diamond shoe boost right there, right? Should be. Should be, should be, should be. Diamond shoe boost, perfect. I need another one. I need another one. Bless me, 2K. Go right. Go right. And maybe? That's perfect. Literally perfect. Literally ideal right now. Triple Threat Online is rewarding. I, I'm going to tell you guys, it's rewarding. You guys can disagree if you guys want, but trust me, I played a lot of Triple Threat Online, and if you can win games, it is rewarding as I get 100 MT right there, which is obviously not the goal, but if you are good at the game, Triple Threat Online is rewarding. I got two more points to give, so I'm going to obviously be at that top board again. More uniforms, which is perfect. Okay, got another court. Let's see here. I didn't mean to open Gus. I'm going to have to quick sell him, which is fine. I mean, obviously, I'm going to have to quick sell most of them anyways. But I'll take it. An extra thousand. I wish I could cut right uh, cut right through this. But every time I get an extra Gus, it's an extra thousand MT. I wish the quick sell value was, you know, what it used to be, which was better than it is. But I'll take it. A thousand MT for Gus the bus again. Look, man, I need to make sure I don't open any more, though, in case... In case there is one that is is useful for like uh you know uh, a, a next next uh exchange or whatever the case might be so let's see here bucks court got some uniforms the diamond shoe boost i need three point i need a three point shoe boost that's what i need because i feel like i could sell that for an od amount right now i don't know what it would go for but i feel like i could sell it for quite a bit we'll see though we'll, we'll, we'll definitely see got a couple uniforms let's see diamond shoe boost just don't give me shot IQ and pass IQ. I feel like that's all I've gotten from y'all so far. Hands. Hands. What is that even? I don't I don't need that. I need speed, three ball, something. Pass accuracy, like. It's going to be hard to get a really souped diamond shoe, I have a feeling. Like, I just have a feeling it's going to be really hard to get a souped diamond shoe. I don't know. Maybe it's me. But I just have a, I have a rough feeling about it in general. Steel, that's a good one. Plus four steel, I feel like is good. Not good enough. It's going for 2,000 MT about rebounding. <laughs> like, I feel like three ball is going for a lot, but a lot of these other ones just don't go for anything. Like, I'm going to put hands and offensive consistency up because I doubt I'll ever use them. The other ones I might use, but I doubt I'm going to use these things. I just, I doubt it. I mean, that's just the way it's going to be. I'm going to just put it up for like that. See if it sells. I don't know if it will or not, but... None on the auction house. Today, what I'm going to try to do for the rest of the day, try to get closer to finishing all-time dime. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish it, but at least try to get closer to that. Triple threat online, hopefully play another game, hopefully get another reward, and just continuing to grind, right? Continuing to grind tokens. Hopefully, to, by tonight, I'll be able to get money, Mitch Richmond. Am I going to grind collector level this year? That might be a question you guys have. I personally am, and one of the main reasons, right, is if you do grind it, just look at all the MT, right? Just MT-wise, that's what I want you guys to focus on. Let's say you hit 3,900 cards, you get 250,000 MT right there. Plus the other MT, 150, you're looking at 400,000 MT right there. Then you get an extra 100,000, you're already looking at 500,000 MT. 
it's basically 600,000 MT plus all the tokens, right? So I do think it's worth it if, if it's something you're interested in. So that's what I'm just going to be working on throughout the course of NBA 2K22 my team. But that is going to wrap it up for the video today, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.